Here's a little Emerson butterfly radio. It's about quarter after seven uh, in the evening on Monday night. I'm in the basement of my workshop and I've got a little four foot uh, simple wire antenna attached to the back of the radio. I've plugged it in and I will go ahead and give it a test uh, first on AM and then on shortwave band. The on off volume switch is on the right. Give it a second to warm up here. Valley Conference. When the story broke, we we're like, wow, courageous. And of course, this whole thing has exploded. And one of the things that I want to discuss and maybe get some reaction from some of our listeners and kind of take take it into a. Racket relief. Relief. R O L A I D S. Now that is spell relief. Uses directed. Acid neutralization may not correlate with symptom relief. Where's the year? Sorry, that's what the guy said, and that's where we stand. But in general, my philosophy on things, in general, we all need to have thicker skins. We all need to have thicker skins. I think our society has gotten to the point where every... Jackson. Plum Grove. It's calm on 8094 65 and the Indiana Toll Road. This report is sponsored by Coca-Cola and the Walmart Deli. When dinner sneaks up on you, let Coca-Cola and the Walmart Deli help with an effortless meal like a delicious 2-liter Coke, 29-ounce market. The Barks from Pansy Art in Bakersfield, California, filling in for the great one. This is the Mark Levin Show. Mark Levin on 77 WABC. Valentine's Day is an absolute dream. We'll be back. That's the Boston, too. Getting some... Uh, well, AM reception... Here, uh, some of the models. AM reception on this radio is, is outstanding. It's a pretty um, hot radio. Picks up lots of uh, good stations on, on this band, despite the uh, interference that... Uh, sometimes caused by these overhead fluorescent shop lights. Let's go ahead and try it on shortwave. Um, shortwave hasn't been particularly good here the last few days, but let's see what we can find. Bad or worse. Yeah. It's a weak station there. Yep, shortwave isn't too good. Um, I don't think this radio is a strong shortwave performer, but uh, usually I've had very poor shortwave performance during the, uh, the evening hours in my basement. Uh, if I had a long outdoor antenna, it might be improved a little bit, but um, certainly we're not picking up too much worth listening to on shortwave. But we'll flip back to AM one more time and see what's there. That's it for the little Emerson Tombstone Radio.